kings and queens of the world. It's Leon X, the human liberator. I'm just checking out the sunset. Today I just turned 25 years old. Today I turned 25. And I also got a call today about one of my homies who, who passed away, who actually drowned in a river and washed up on the shore this morning. My birthday, my man washes up on the shore because he drowned. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Life Force, for my purpose. Thank you for my deliverance from the old way of thinking. Thank you for allowing me to be born again and again and again and again and be born anew. Being born in the new. Be restored by the renewing of your mind. And I ha didn't get this enlightenment until I got renewed of the mind. I subscribe to a particular set of morals and doctrine and culture and tradition, but I didn't get the information until I started seeking the information. So I developed the appetite for the information. The church preaches about the divinity of Jesus. Jesus preaches about the divinity of man. That was his great discovery. It talked about his birth, and then he didn't come back till he was in his 30s. He had to live life and refine his philosophy and get the great discovery. And I'm an amateur on the Bible, but I'm sure it does also say that Jesus said in his words that anything that I do, if you believe on me, then you can, you know, do them two plus more. He didn't say in me, he said on me, believe on me, understanding that what he believed in is his connection with the source. He broke the psychological barrier between man and God. And he is our savior being our example, knowing that we don't have to live this life of mediocrity. We don't have to live this life on the lower level of, of consciousness. We have divine intelligence. We are infinite spirits. We are spiritual beings in a human experience versus a human being having spiritual experiences. And so that's what it boils down to. That's the information that changes situations. Understanding that you have the power. You have the power because you're connected with everything that there ever was to connect with. The whole world was meant for us to have dominion and power and authority over. Develop your inner man, your inner woman, your inner God, your inner source. Get connected. Jesus is our example for us to know that there is a personal relationship that, that can be had within. Jesus shows men the realm of possibilities. Jesus shows men at his highest developed state. And he in his, is an example but you have to make a decision for Christ because it was the Christ that was in Jesus, the Christ that was in Jesus, which allowed him to perform the miracles that he performed, for, that allowed him to do all the things that, that he could do. So I'm thankful. I'm so thankful for being taught and told about Jesus. It wasn't until I stepped outside of the box step outside of the particular doctrine understanding that this is the holy bible and there's over like 40 religions that came from this one book and everyone has to be right I had to step outside of what i was particularly taught to understand the words to understand that the bible is the first self-help book ever understanding the origin of the bible where it came from the the truths and the trickery how it was used by the controlling classes to manipulate our people. And it also shows their whole entire agenda and it lets us know as black people what we need to do to move forward. Matter of fact, it lets us know knowledge of self. We are the, the Israelites, the Hebrew slaves. Knowledge of the times. This is the time of Christ consciousness. Jesus isn't coming back as far as his physical it wasn't Jesus coming back, it was Christ coming back. Coming back to man at his highest state. Man all understanding consciousness and, and uh, the great discovery. And knowledge of what must be done is people like me, once I have the information, I have to give the information. 
I have to share the information.